Police tonight uncover a pot growing operation at a house in northeast Minneapolis. And how they found it is a pretty bizarre story involving fake hazmat suits, neighbors tackling would-be robbers, and some pretty elite alert police officers. Fox 9's Eric Rung joins us tonight with all the details. Eric? Around about 9.30 this morning, police say two people dressed as hazmat workers busted into a home and beat up the people inside before running out with cash in their pockets. They ended up getting caught, but police say there's a good chance that people who got beat up will also be arrested. Strange story, right? And I haven't even gotten to the drugs yet. There's a good chance people living on this street will be talking about this Thanksgiving for a very long time. Shot to walk out the door at 10 o'clock in the morning on Thanksgiving and I see a gang of police cars, ambulances, fire trucks and I'm like, what's going on? A legitimate question about a number of illegitimate things that caught the attention of so many different people in different departments this morning on Minneapolis's northeast side. Well, I didn't know what was going on. Police say two people wearing hazmat suits busted into this home and beat up the couple inside before trying to get away. Well, the teenager heard screaming this morning from the girl, I guess, who was trying to crawl out, and the guy pulled her back in. She was all bloody. Neighbors tell me after they heard the woman screaming, the people who live in this home here ran out of their house and actually tackled the two people in the hazmat suits and held them for police. That's kind of bizarre, really. Hold on, there's another twist. Are you serious? Oh my goodness. When police went inside the home, they smelled something funny and got out of there and called the fire department. Yeah, I think at first they thought it was a meth house because the people were wearing those suits. It was a real hazmat team this time. They didn't find a meth lab, but they did find a lot of marijuana plants, which are inside these garbage bags. Police also brought out equipment for growing pot and weed already bagged. Oh, you can smell it from clear down the block down there. So, yeah, it's pretty potent. Police say the couple who lives here will likely face a number of charges. The two people in the fake hazmat suits were already taken to jail. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is crazy. On Thanksgiving. What a Thanksgiving. At least the neighborhood will remember what they did this Thanksgiving. Now, here's another strange twist for this story. When police went to find the guy uh, and the woman that were beat up at the hospital to talk to him about the drugs, police say he took off in a hospital gown. Eric Rung, Fox 9 News. Uh